Ms. Herting Ru. Not here. Mr. Henry Quack. Mr. Chairman, Russia's invasion of Ukraine and with it a new world order is unfolding before our very eyes. There are many lessons we can draw from the new reality. A strong SCF is vital in deterring potential aggressors and in protecting Singapore's peace and stability. We cannot expect others to shed blood for us. Therefore, we must work hard to build the next generation SAF and stay ahead of rapidly changing defence and warfare. For example, with the rapid evolution of technology, interstate conflicts may no longer manifest in conventional physical or kinetic modes. Conflicts could instead be conducted through grey zone tactics below the threshold of war or through attacks in the cyber and digital domains where most of us now live and work following the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic. And even as the domains and modalities for conflicts continue to expand and grow, existing threats to our peace and security, such as terrorism, remain salient. I also recognize the importance of the SEF, ensuring that its platform and capabilities serve as a credible deterrent to conventional military threats. Indeed, any perceived weak points in our military capabilities is a vulnerability that could be exploited and the SAF must be ready and prepared to respond to the ever-growing range of challenges to defend Singapore. As a small country with a shrinking total fatality rate, we can expect subsequent national service cohorts to similarly decrease in size in future. And at the very same time, new technologies arise, arising from the fourth industrial revolution such as AI, digital analytics, and the Internet of Things offer new opportunities for the SEF to leverage as a force multiplier to overcome manpower limitations. I welcome the efforts to build the next generation SEF as MINDEF and the SEF first announced in 2019. It is timely and necessary that the SEF harness technology to respond better to security threats. Could the Minister for Defence update the House on the progress of the transformation efforts towards the next generation SEF? Thank you.